Hello everybody, welcome back. Today we are doing a 10 minute intense core and abs workout. I have a dumbbell here with me today. It is optional for one of the exercises. You don't necessarily need it, but it will increase the intensity. Make sure that you can see your screen so you can follow along with me. And without further ado, let's get to it. All right, so how today's workout is going to work is we have two exercises, each for a minute, then we're gonna hold 30 seconds of plank. We're not taking any rest today. Your first exercise is a dumbbell pullover. You're going to drop legs and arms, and then you're gonna bring them up together. So this is where the dumbbell comes in. This will increase the intensity of this movement, but you could also do this without the dumbbell entirely. So you wanna make sure that you're keeping that back press to the floor as much as possible, belly button to spine. Keep a nice bend in those elbows. Good, we're gonna put that dumbbell aside. Fingertips are gonna come by the ears. You're gonna have your legs bent, tapping your bottom heel to the floor, shoulder blades up, and we're switching. So make sure your neck is nice and long. You're not pulling on your neck. Fingertips are just there to support your head, keeping the back press to the floor. All right, we're getting ready to flip it over into a plank. You can hold this plank however you wish to hold plank, whether that be on your forearms or on your hands. You could also add some spice to your planks by doing some hip dips, or you can rock forward and backwards. You can do commando. So we're here for 30 seconds, then we're gonna go back and do both of those same exercises again right away, so no rest today. Here we go, back on your back with the dumbbell. Take it nice and slow. We're here for a minute. Good, dumbbell aside, fingertips to the ears. <clears throat> Keep those shoulders open, shoulder blades up off the floor.
and getting ready to hold plank. All right, so that was our first half of the workout. We're gonna move into the second half. So now we're gonna switch up those two minute interval exercises. So the first one, we're going to come onto our bums and we're gonna support ourselves on our forearms. So flip it over, chest is open, legs are bent. You're gonna drop the feet into a Y position, bring them back to center. Then from here, extend them both forwards and back in. So dropping together, stretch and bend. Remember not to let the lower back go here. Keep the low abs engaged, back is straight. Good. We're going to come down onto our backs, tabletop position with the legs, arms above head. You're going to come up for a crunch and extend one leg, fingertips touch underneath the leg, back to center. So exhale as you come up for the crunch, really press the low back into the floor bringing your belly button to your spine. Neck is nice and long. and getting ready to hold plank. Make sure your body's in a nice straight line. And we're getting ready to do those same two exercises again. So coming back onto our bums and on our elbows. Back is nice and straight, lower abs are engaged. Then we drop to a Y position and then extend. If you need to make this a little bit easier, you can extend the legs higher. The lower you extend the legs, the harder it's going to be. and coming all the way down on our backs. Legs and tabletop, single leg crunch.
And last 30 seconds, holding plank. This is your last 30 seconds, so if you did not add some spice to any of your planks, now is the time to do so. Good. Stretch out those abs. Let those hips sink down into the floor. Take a couple deep breaths. Good, and press it back. And that is it, guys. Great job. I hope you enjoyed this 10 minute intense core abs workout. If you did, Give this video a thumbs up. Let me know how you enjoyed it in the comments. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button. Turn on your post notifications so you don't miss another video from me and I will see you guys next time. Bye.